Usually, the only problem people living on Ray Road and unincorporated Shreveport deal with is speeding cars. But that all changed this week when nine cars were broken into. All nine of these vehicle break-ins could have been prevented from something as easy as a beep. This is what we might call just a, a crime of opportunity. Um, I don't know if there was any, you know, planning involved in this or if people just walked by and saw, you know, noticed it, you know, checked it, cars unlocked, you open the door, you take what's inside. Most of the cars were missing loose change and cigarettes, but that's not all. We did have one that reported a, uh, a gun that was taken, so certainly that would be of concern to the sheriff's office. My son's car, they got a backpack that had some of his company's stuff in it, probably about $3,000 worth of stuff. This isn't the first time crime has struck some of these families. Uh, it's happened before, about probably six or eight months ago. Same thing. <laughs> Simmons didn't start locking his door after that break-in, but he certainly plans to now. In Caddo Parish, Annie Anderson, Fox 33 News, Arklatex.